Now, she was the rape victim in Dubai, treated as a criminal. Norwegian businesswoman uh, Marte Deborah de Lave was sentenced to 16 months in jail for having sex outside marriage after reporting an attack by a co-worker. Her treatment stirred widespread outrage in the West, and today the Dubai authorities said she had been pardoned. Ms. Delalev had her passport back, but the case has highlighted the clash between Dubai's Western-friendly image and its Islamic-based legal codes. Our international editor, Lindsay Hilsom, has this. The relief, the joy, she's free. The court pardoned Marta Dalel, a victim regarded in Dubai as a criminal. Today we were summoned to the meeting and they told me I've been pardoned and that I get my passport, I will get my passport and I'm free to go. 50 years of distinctiveness and devotion. The Dubai police promote themselves as a modern force. Ambiguous crimes have been solved by the Dubai police. But when Ms. Dalel reported that she'd been raped by a work colleague in a hotel, she was thrown in prison and then tried and convicted of having sex outside marriage, drinking alcohol and giving false testimony. We saw the verdict against Marta Deborah Dalel as going against international human rights and our sense of justice. It's not supposed to be like that. When a woman reports a rape to the police, she ends up facing a conviction herself. In April, the United Arab Emirates leader, Sheikh Khalifa Al Nahyan, made a state visit to the UK. Relations are close, cordial, and lucrative despite cases like this, which campaigners say are not uncommon. I think that it's particularly shocking that rape victims are treated like criminals in the UAE and that women have this insurmountable burden of proof in proving what's happened to them. There's a social stigma attached with rape in the UAE. Women are considered impure or defiled. And thankfully for Marta, she can now go home to Norway. But there are plenty of Emirati women who have been raped who cannot escape in the way that Marta has done. Hundreds of thousands of expatriates live in the Emirates. The moral of Ms. Dalel's story is simple. If you're raped there, say nothing, because the men who run this glittering city won't blame your rapist, they'll blame you. Lindsay Hilson reporting.